Ramona Chang began her educational career in 1982 as a special education elementary teacher in grades K through 5 in Southern California. She later served as the assistant principal and later principal, and she focused on using student data to guide teachers' classroom practices. In 2004, Dr. Chang became the director of curriculum for the Torrance Unified School District, overseeing professional development and curriculum and implementation for both teachers and administrators. Dr. Chang has participated in the Mickelson Exxon Mobile Math and Science Teachers Academy, I think for four years, is that correct, Dr. Chang? And we welcome you to the, uh, to the committee. Congressman Miller and honorable members of the committee, it is with great pleasure that I'm here today to speak to you about the Mickelson Exxon Mobile Teachers Academy. My name is Dr. Ramona Chang, and I'm the Director of Curriculum for Torrance Unified School District in Torrance, California. Our district, as well as other districts throughout the country, face a difficult challenge. The curriculum standards for our students have become more rigorous, and accountability for both teachers and schools has increased exponentially. Teachers must provide high-caliber learning experiences for our students. However, all too often, our teachers rely on scripted textbook instructional outlines or uninspiring labs. If our students are to become our future engineers, computer scientists, mathematicians, and environmentalists, we need to change the way we approach the teaching of math and science. A systemic change in teaching requires ongoing, powerful professional development in math and science. And through the collaborative efforts of Phil and Amy, ExxonMobil, National Science Teachers Association, and Math Solutions, an exemplary professional academy for elementary educators has been realized. As I reflect back on the past three years, and one day, because I had that yesterday, of our involvement with the Academy, I am amazed by the dynamic and exciting results that have been achieved through the process. During our week at the Academy, our teachers together with other teachers from all over the United States collaboratively worked together to focus on math and science curriculum with the resulting successful outcomes of our students. With the Academy Week as our starting point for our Torrance team, our teachers are able to continue their professional development at their individual school site as they apply their new knowledge in their daily work with our students. An additional benefit of the Academy has also been the development of teacher leadership. Their skills, when they return back, have been in a variety of roles in terms of district curriculum committees and fields that connect themselves to math and science as well. As an ever-growing team of academy teachers in Torrance, we continue to meet at the district level in order to build new learning experiences for each other. If you were to drop by one of our sessions, you would see teachers experimenting with new teaching strategies, all with the focus of continuously increasing their effectiveness with science and math instruction. Academy teachers have been taught to plan creatively, teach constructively, and reflect objectively. These skills rank in the proverbial priceless category for educators. Creating change one grade level at a time, although commendable, could not ensure positive student outcome. Through an extended period of time, we learned that we needed to tap into our academy experts in order to create a district-wide math and science fervor. The first year cadre got that process started by working together as a district leadership team focused on the alignment of state math content standards. We meet on a regular basis for the purposes of learning, lesson planning, and problem solving together. Since we already represented several grade levels, these are third through fifth grade teachers, we felt the next step was to develop more vertical grade level articulations, which we believed was essential in laying the necessary groundwork for success in subsequent math courses. What we quickly realized was that our discussions needed to include both middle and high school teachers. This resulted in the development of a kindergarten to 12th grade, and that's advanced placement calculus teachers, with us in the one room, and we call ourselves a math achievement committee. Teacher committee members focus their attention on examining the standards students are required to master, planning more effective lessons, and solving the new challenges of teaching. As a team, they determined which additional professional learning would be helpful to assist them in acquiring the necessary knowledge of skills. This has resulted in a district-wide common focus and clear direction for professional and student improvement in math and science. At the end of this year's academy, we will have 36 educators that have had this wonderful experience. We've enjoyed learning in wonderful facilities as well, such as this year's academy at the Liberty Science Center. 
the quality professional development that the Academy provides is key for supporting significant improvements in student learning and professional learning of teachers. Inquiry and reflection with other Academy teachers has changed the culture of our schools and district. As a group, we have developed a mindset that educators build intellectual strength through a high level of rigor and depth. The experience of the Academy helped build that mindset, and it is that mindset that will nurture and support our citizens of tomorrow, our students of today.